Hey, hey, what is up? YouTube, Andrew Rooney here, full-time drummer and drum teacher based right here in Auckland, New Zealand. We are back with a mystery PayPal request. We will call this person Matthew. Now the message here. Hey Andrew, I found you through your reactions to some Tori Amos videos. I'm a piano player, not a drummer, and you don't need to read any of this out in a video. But I'd love to hear your thoughts you have on the drumming of Brian or the interaction between piano and drums on this one. Heads up, there's a false start if you want to cut it. All right, I've brought up the link. It is the Dresden Dolls. War pigs? As in Black Sabbath? Live in Paradise 2005. False start. All right, I have no idea. of. I don't think I've even heard of this group before. Definitely never heard them. Warpigs, I'm liking the sound of that. Without further ado, let's check it out. Just the two of them? So the last time we played this song here, on this very stage, uh, it was election time. Encouraging all you motherfuckers to go out and vote and We all know how that ended up but It's 2005 it's a new year and there's more elections in 2008 So you know what to fucking do <laughs> Again, it is the the war picks. Cool pills. Sound of this kit. Gathered in their masses Just like witches at black masses Evil minds that plot destruction Sorcerer of death construction In the fields the bodies burning As the war machine keeps turning and hatred to mankind oh, Poisoning their amazing. brainwashed minds Oh Lord, yeah Start this one over because we're playing it too fast <laughs> and I can't keep up. <laughs> Hold on, but if you can rally that same enthusiasm, let's try this again. Twice as much hatred. What? Okay, I'll leave this in the video. This is interesting. Um, that's highly unusual to just start a song again because it was too fast. Really unusual. Hey. I quite like the arrangement. I quite like the sounds here. Ah! 
They were well into the song too, a good couple of minutes. beat in the bar there before they did the ban arm they did that this, uh, the first time as well interesting Generals gathered in their masses just like witches at black masses evil minds that plot destruction Construction in the fields, the bodies burning as the war machine keeps turning. Death and hatred to mankind. That's the money, poisoning film. their brainwashed minds. Oh, Lord. Doesn't feel a lot slower than before. Oh, damn! Crawling, 
begging mercy for their sins Satan laughing spreads his wings Oh Lord, yeah! Oh, what, a, what got knocked over there? Oh, man! I don't think I've ever even heard of this group before. The Dresden Dolls. The Dresden Dolls are an American music duo from Boston, Massachusetts, formed in 2000. The group consists of Amanda Palmer, lead vocals piano, keyboards harmonica ukulele, and Brian Viglioni, drums and backing vocals, additional guitar, bass guitar. The two describe their style as Brechtian punk cabaret i'm not even cultured enough to know what that's all about a phrase invented by palmer because she was terrified that the press would invent a name that would involve the word gothic the dresden dolls aesthetic exemplifies dark cabaret okay and on the wikipedia page it's got them both of them you know quite um strong makeup and like very theatrical type makeup Interesting. Um, Brian Viglioni. This is a serious drummer. You know, you can tell a lot about a drummer, you know, within a short space of time. Like, I mean, within, uh, you know, hearing them within one song. You can hear this person knows how to tune a drum kit, knows how to hit a drum kit, and plays with some really stunning authority. And you can just hear straight away, wow. This is some real deal player. So super, super impressed in the drumming. Great pocket, great feel, great tone, awesome fill ideas. Reaching for those hurter fills, you know, trying to um, change gears and go up the subdivisions and really, really effective. Some really, really cool stuff in there while still referencing constantly the original track 
By the way, guys, I have done a note for note drum cover on War Pigs. You'll find it on my channel. Just go to the search bar, search War Pigs, you'll see it. So I know the track fairly well. Um, and yeah, this was innovative, but still paying a lot of respect to the original. It's a really interesting juxtaposition and simplicity, obviously, in the vocal, in the, sorry, the instrumentation, just having the two piece, but also with two extra instruments, kind of, on the two vocals. You wouldn't normally think of drums and piano working together, but it worked really well there and it requires a really full full bodied sound on the drums the drums are carrying a lot it's actually rem reminds me i guess a little bit of the setup that you get in 21 pilots where you've got drums and bass although with a thousand backing tracks um in there as well reminiscent of that and that it's an unlikely duo of instruments but they just make it work and the key here is that it's the opposite in terms of that it's completely raw no tracks and we're just going in and we're going to make it work as a duo even though this shouldn't work really really appreciate there on the vocal style how she was going for some like now gotta be careful what i say here don't take this the wrong way going for some ugly notes from the point of view of getting the message and the words of the song across in like an ugly way and also I guess replacing some of those harsh sounds that you're used to hearing in the song possibly just on the original with the distorted guitar and that kind of thing and getting some of those gnarly parts because clean piano I mean as clean piano is like beautiful right it's just clean and you know how are we going to do war pigs which is supposed to be this aggressive distorted thing but we're on a clean piano and i just really thought that was cool how she again but got to be careful but made some ugly choices in the vocals it really gave it a little bit of crunchiness well a lot of crunchiness and a lot of interest you know along with some nice vocals as well of course but um yeah this is kind of hard on the sleeve stuff and i really appreciate it very theatrical i didn't really get a good handle on what type of venue this is what type of venue this group would play it feels obviously quite artsy it's the type of group that's probably going to have a cult following more than anything um but yeah i'm left with a lot of questions and probably not a lot of answers from this video very very intriguing uh this was a mystery paypal request so matthew Thank you so much for this. And um, guys, are there any other Dresden Dolls fans out there? Hit me in the comments. Give me some info. Give me another song or two to check out. And I'll be very, very curious to learn more about this group. Very intriguing. Guys, until next time, take care. Keep chopping wood. Ciao. Hey, what is up wood choppers? Please do remember original video links as always in the description of each video. Please do go along, check it out and support the artist. If you enjoy my channel, please do consider hitting that subscribe button, like button and leaving a comment down below with what you thought of this video and what you would like me to check out in the future. If you would like to support my channel further, I do have a Patreon. It's just $5 a month and you will get access to the blocked videos. If you have a reaction request that you definitely want to get on the channel, the only way I can guarantee that at this point is via the PayPal link and it supports the channel. So thanks in advance. And remember you as a subscriber of my channel, you get access to a full and free 30 day trial over at Dromeo. Learn from the world's best drummers and drum teachers. And they've got over 6,000 songs in the database downloadable pds for those transcriptions or you can play along watch in the player slow down loop sections it is truly awesome go check it out 30 days free on me guys until next time keep chopping wood take it easy ciao